There we go. Welcome back, everybody. I don't know what's going on with my OBS. It's being weird as fuck. I hate those things so much. <sighs> so, if you guys don't know what this is, this is the murky water station. And like I've been doing a lot, I've been doing it on one down. Oh, shit. Camera already right there. It's kind of... If you've never played this mission, then it's pretty much, you want to destroy everything, not like destroy, destroy, but you want to get everyone down underground and pretty much just take underground for yourself. that and let's go fuck you we're just gonna keep all the loot down here and hi there buddy just remove the screws move the vent and boom we're inside over here and of course there's a camera right there. The hard drive, like Lily, if you take everyone down here and get free rain down here, it makes this mission like three times easier. Especially if you just do some weird shit like that. Wow, that was a huge leg drop. I've never had that big of a leg drop. I like the music. Okay, bag this corpse. And what is that? There's the key card. Quickly just go in here. And drop the body right there. Beautiful. I think the moment you take everyone down underground, the cameras become disabled, if I'm not mistaken. There's a way to disable the cameras, I just can't remember it off the top of my head. Hi there, buddy. You're just gonna stay down here. I ain't moving you. And then pretty much the, like when you're up top, you don't need to worry about anything. You just find the right train, open it, open all the trains if you want all the stuff, and then just keep moving from there. So what else? Where's the other side? Okay, so this was a one-way door. Okay, right. that's good to know. Okay, okay. Any more people? Yeah, there you are. Three down already, and that should be all that are down here. Pretty much you just want to take the three down, leave one body bag in case you need to kill someone up top. Okay. Three are down on the ground. And if I'm not mistaken, that should be all of them. Wait, but where are the cameras? That's how you view them. Where was the switch? There's a switch to literally turn off the cameras, if I'm not mistaken. How do I turn these off again? I haven't done this mission in forever, so like I'm trying to remember everything. That camera's not even facing me. Oh, 
By the way, you guys, I do not currently have a phone. Mine is broken, and I'm in the process of buying a new one. So, I am without a phone for a while. No, you cannot. That. I'm <sighs> not dealing with civilians down here, so... Tie him down. Is that the only civilian down here? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, let's move up now. I always come through this side, so... Get the fence open. Hide from him. There's actually an opening for once over here. You see there's not an opening. I see you. Ah, fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. Cut that one. And F, cut this one. And, okay. So, no EMP in the first train. But... Oh. Hi there. That would have been bad. It would have been very, very bad. I was not looking at that at all. And all you do is move the stuff to this side, and then you move them all on the ground. As you know, this can be a tricky mission if you don't do it the way I'm doing it. This is one of the missions I've done to get myself up to level 60 in relatively shorter time period. The reason if you can if you can get the EMP on your first try, like the first train, you can just peace out. But if you're like me, I like trying to get all of the fucking hell. My OBS is lagging out, and I'm almost certain that when I look back at this, my whole entire game is going to be lagging out. I'm going to have to redo it. Okay, I want to get everything. Moment changes from the bottom one goes up to the top. Boom. That's all you gotta do. You, you, you just need to know where the lasers go. The moment you know where the lasers are, then you can move. And one more. Pistols. Until they cycle back down and then move through the lasers. Boom. Easy as that. Okay. Oh fuck, who saw me? Who saw me? Who did see me? It was probably that one guy that was just turning the corner that saw me. There. Ooh, that would have been bad. And never do that. Never just, like, run out of the train and not look. That was really stupid of me to do. Ah, fucking hell. Okay. So one train, car is down. 
Yeah, jump. Got a second train car right there that I need it. Managed to get over to and hack. But the hacking panel is all the way down there. Nope, never mind. The hacking panel is all the way on the other side. There's the hacking panel for that one. And there's the one for that. Okay. So. Eh, you shit. This is fun. Honestly, the hardest part is maneuvering the drones, in my opinion. Person's coming. Where are you going? Buddy? Packing the doors. And as you can see, right to the right, I'm pointing at, but you can't see where it says the slip and fall sign. There is ladders down there. Okay, so we got one of the bomb parts. Now we gotta find the other one. I think usually they're like in the same exact train. Now is the part where we actually try to move it. That's easier, honestly. As long as the guard doesn't stand right in front of your exit. I'm just surrounded right now, like, it's not even funny. Okay, what about now? There we go. Now you just gotta be careful with cameras. And the cameras are really easy to avoid in this. If you honestly can't avoid cameras like this, then I don't know how you manage to play Payday. That's all I got for you. Cameras, they're so stupid. If you actually go with the loadout, which I'll show you the loadout afterward, you just can walk by all of them, as long as you're not an idiot. The good thing about cameras in this game actually is they don't chain. Like if you go from one camera view to another, it resets technically. Two million. Boom. You can go down. I gotta move all the bags from that one side over. Not gonna go there. Actually, hold on. I want to grab the... Um, don't need the key card. I already, I already still have one. And... Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Where was it? Oh, more rifles. Cool. Where was it? I'm trying to find the server. Oh, there it is. Because you were in one down, you are going to need the hard drives. It's one of the reasons why I actually do like 
going solo more is yeah you need to go collect everything yourself but if if someone in your team has like a higher detection than you and they grab something you have to hope they can make it through all right guys i'm gonna be right back i need to check to see if this is actually working like the actual obs okay so yeah my obs like screen is literally just lagging right now so i didn't know if it was actually like recording properly but now Payday just goes. Uh. Ah. Of course, when I'm like, usually I have a lot of trouble with this mission, and the one time I don't have trouble, it freezes. Gonna try fixing it. I have no clue if this is still recording my face or not because I just hit like Control Alt Delete and it brings up that screen and my other screen. So I'm gonna find out. It's recording. Please work. Hey, there we go. Now we're now we're working again. Okay. I got the server, I got the blowtorch, I got the key card. Pretty much anything that can prevent me from getting in. Unless there's supposed to be I think there is supposed to be thermite. Fuck. I need to go find the thermite. Stop freezing. Thank you. But yeah, and additional loot. If you can, grab as much as you can. This mission pays out nicely if you manage. No, don't do that right when I'm about to enter a camera's view. But yeah, I would highly suggest that you only use one body bag on the ground, like right in here, and save your other body bag for if you have to down someone outside. Because there should be, there usually is three. Occasionally I have had it have four underneath in the construction area. And then just kind of like you don't need body bags anymore. But if there is a civilian up top next to like the blowtorch or anything. And you have a clearing, just shoot the civilian, bag his body, and grab the thermite slash blowtorch. Don't try downing them. It takes way too long in this mission. If you get caught, you have like... I think a minute to find both parts and it's just not enough time. Okay. Fuck you too, camera. Time to come up here. Grab you. Throw you down there. And do the same with you. I'm just gonna throw all the stuff down here and I'm gonna move it afterwards. And when I move it, like usual, shit, I never did that. <laughs> I didn't realize, like usual, whenever I'm doing something that's really boring, I usually skip through it. But last video, I kinda forgot about it, I fell asleep. And then I just uploaded it and I forgot to edit it. Shit. Oh, I'm sorry about that, you guys. I'm Jump. That's the train. This train should have what we're looking for. I think we have a plan. This train should have the last bomb part in it. I've always seen it spawn on the same train. I've never seen one bomb part on one train and one bomb part on the other train. That opened. Fuck. It's not on this one. Oh! Hey, look, I was right.
Okay. Now the fun part. I'm trying to figure out what to do to escape. So I can just throw my ECM jammer and blitz it. If I don't feel like grabbing the rat. Boom! Got both the bomb parts. First try. Well, let me know. This was my first try doing it. For the well, I should say I do this mission quite often on my on the side, uh, like off camera. But usually I have to do it a few times, get everything perfect down underground. Rarely have I ever just started and finished it with very low problems. So I'm actually really happy about this. Now, I just move the rest of the guns and shit. So, guys, do not worry. I will actually do this this time. I actually, like, skip through it. I think I'm probably also just going to, like, fast forward, like, four times speed. So you at least can see it so you don't guys, so you guys don't think I'm cheating. Fuck the cameras. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Bam. Not a game of just toss the bags. See this part, usually a lot of times if I do stealth missions I have one guy that's just designated once when we clear a route just to move bags. Now, I'm gonna just start the um, speaker of some. Okay, so we got one last one left, and I'm just going to actually talk during this one. I kind of hate just recording and not speaking. It's one of the reasons why I don't do, like, videos with the rants when it's just gameplay over and then, like, dialogue over it, is I have to actually play those and record those, and with my setup, it's just really annoying. Like, I just want us to talk instead while doing the games, so... So we didn't need the thermite, which is on the second floor, like up near the trains. Fuck you too. Yeah. Fuck you too, bro. So we did this completely stealth first try. I'm actually really, really amazed. And it only took about 12 minutes. No, 30 minutes. My bad. I looked at the OBS timer and I realized I stopped halfway through just to double check to make sure it was working right. But there you go. There you have it. Murky Water Station. First try. One down. Wow. While everything lights up. And I got all the achievements. Blackout. It's just drones on and on. And the one for one down. Honestly, I will say this. If you can do any mission stealthily on Death Wish, you can do them on one down. Just be prepared for missions like Nightclub, where it's thugs and not security guards. You will need to bring a strong gun or load a lot of bullets into them with the pistol. They're not that strong. It 
and we got stripes below. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you guys in the next one. Tomorrow, right? Eh, yeah, fuck it. If I feel like uploading a third one today, I will. Have a great day, everyone, and remember, like, comment, subscribe, and always stay real. Thank you.